Hey everyone, welcome to Streaming with Steven, where I am playing Minecraft on the multiplayer server called The Citadel. Um, this evening, I'm going to be taking a bit of a taking a bit of a departure from my usual work on the Temple of Ascension here, and I'm going to go help. I don't even know if I'm going to help. I'm going to. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! All of the zombies already. This is not how I wanted this to go. Oh. All right. Realize I need to have my. Seriously, can they break that? Mad dash out into the sunlight. Oh no, I'm stuck down here. Great. gonna kill me right at the beginning of the screen stream ah. well, at least now there's the other two are dead so I can go back into the hey man made welcome I'm just about dying here at the very beginning of a stream thanks to a uh, child zombie this is not this is not what I need I came on here to go help Cosmic <laughs> in the end, and here I am getting battered by a small child. Wait, right, wait, where's my bow? Alright. Right. Hey, Fire Pith, welcome. Jeez, let's die already, little one. That was not the best start to a stream. <laughs> oh well. Welcome everyone, we've got Man Made and Fire Pith in the chat here, good to see you. Uh, my plan is to go help Cosmic in the end, if I can actually get out of my own way and go do that. Um, but in order to do that, I need to get rid of, not get rid of, but put away my good stuff which means I'm gonna need some less than good stuff which is unfortunate because I'm not sure how much of that I have this was a bit unplanned from my, on my part and so there we go we got a bow fantastic I'll bring some rockets just in case I don't need any of these stone things on me um, torches probably not buckets nope uh, maybe a water bucket Water bucket or two. So I'll keep those. Don't need that. 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 Food is important, so I'll keep that. Um, yeah. Arrows. Good. I think my boots are almost dead, so we'll take those. No, my pants are almost dead. So we'll leave the boots here. So how's everyone doing this evening? So if you're not um, already following Cosmic, you should go have a, check out her channel right now because she is in the end, and she is uh, she's adventuring like crazy. So let's take two pickaxes. That's good. I don't think I'll need a shovel. Um, Ender pearls will be great, so I'll take those. As well as coarse fruit, nummy num. Hey, Obsidian, just heading to work and leaving. Okay, cool. Thank you very much. Thanks for popping in. Much appreciated. Oh, it happened. If bingo were a thing, that would have been the catalyst for this evening's bingo. Uh, until tomorrow. All right, so there's a sword. That's good. We've got a sword. My, my shield ain't fancy. It's not actually that, that much durability left on it. I don't think I have any iron on me here. So I may have to go get some of that. All right, let's take a look at what we have on. So, oh yes, Elytra, you stay here. Ye shall not come with me. You go there. 
Um, helmet. That's a good helmet. We'll leave that here. Plus, we're going to need a pumpkin head anyway, which we have there. Fantastic. Um, bow power one. Sure, we'll bring. We'll bring the two bows with durability, with the higher dur durability. Cool. How do I look? I look underprepared, but <laughs> we're going to do this anyway. So I have pickaxes, sword, shield, bow, and food. I have no need for that. I might have that on me still. No need for rockets. Unless we, unless we find an electric and come back. No need for torches. All right, sort of the bare minimum here. Actually, we'll leave the rockets in the in the end of chest. I'm bringing six of them now. All right, I think this is probably okay to get started. I'm just gonna take another look over here. So depending on how this trip to the end goes, I may come back and end up working on the pillars over here a little bit. Oh wait. I do have iron. I believe that was a block of iron in my manor chest. Silly me. It was fantastic. Let's adventure to the end, y'all. Is there anything else you think I need? Probably some building blocks. I've got a ton of stone over here. I'll go grab blocks and blocks of stone. Just to help build out. And I'm going to grab a crafting table as well. Because I have a feeling I'm going to need to make some stairs because Cosmic... <laughs> Was building towers over there, so. Where do I have another one in there? I do not. But good to know that there are torches in there. I completely forgot that. I've never eaten one of these down here. Right? Nice. That actually did what I wanted it to. It does. Does it always move you forward? That's pretty handy. Probably not, but I'm digging that. It's going to be my safety thing when uh, shulkers attack me because I hate getting attacked by shulkers. Good to know. Thank you, Firepith. So off to the end. Very likely horribly unprepared, but we're going anyway. So make sure I have arrows. I do. So just by chance it had actually uh, moved me forward three times. Well, all right. So I'm going to do a quick check-in on my phone with Cosmic to uh, see what her coordinates are. I need to worry about it for now, I guess. Let's get down to the end first. Survive that first bit of business, and then we will uh, worry about where Cosmic is. Oh, that's a great sound to start off the stream. Oh no, Cosmic! She fell out of the world! Oh, that means she lost her stuff. That's terrible. <laughs> I was just on my way to try to help. Oh, Eldabar! Subscribes to Tier 1 for three months. Awesome! Thank you so much! Worst timing ever. Did you see that? I feel so bad. Sub, sub hype for sure. Thank you so much, Eldabar.
Probably shouldn't have opened that chest. Were you on Cosmic Stream? Oh. Uh, poor Cosmic. Saw the in-game message. Oh, she did get them. Did you do it on purpose? Did you do it on purpose? That'd be awesome. In which case, that would completely change what I had planned for this stream. So we would probably go, you got the wings, put the stuff in the inner chest, and jumped in the void. Oh my goodness. All right. That's awesome. All right. Well. Change my stream plans. That is perfectly cool. I would much rather that be the case than not. Well, for those of you who have not been on my stream before, that was, uh, or seen how to get down to the end before, that was a quick way to get there from, from my place, so. Happy it worked out. Alright, so I'm going to head back to my... Yes, I'm going to head back to whence I came. Um... Head back to the temple. Congratulations again. The music balance is a bit different because it's the actual in game music. Um, is it, do you find it too loud now? There's, um, there was somebody in um, Joel's uh, Discord that posted that they had found a a mod that keeps Minecraft music playing the entire time. So I, d I decided to give that a go for a couple of them. Um, a couple of streams, I mean. So far, um, oh, we've got a bit of a, a parte right here, do we? Move it! Um... Yeah, so I just thought I'd give uh, give the actual Minecraft music a bit of a go for a few streams in a row, just just to see if it's if I like it. There's something that I do like about it quite a bit, but then it's uh, sometimes it's nice to have the other music changing uh, the uh, the constant change of that other music. It would be good. <laughs> Filled our belly with carbs, and now we can... <laughs> it's funny. I'll just eat six potatoes and then run faster. Just an observation? Okay. Well, we can we can change that. Um, as you can sound. Let's try 70 for now. See how that goes. So thank you for the observation. Good to know. Nobody mentioned anything last time, so I didn't really have a gauge as to how people were finding it. I should say people didn't mention it, other than they liked having the Minecraft music there. Oh, I don't want to die here. I left the door open. Gosh darn it. Alright. Cool. Alright, so I guess we're going to now... Um, let's restart the stream. <laughs> a reset. So I started a half hour early to go join Cosmic. I was not needed, so I'm headed back to the temple. Where I shall continue on with my, my lighting plan. Or a renewed lighting plan. We're going to try something here. Um, 
Now let's just trade things up. Don't need that. Actually, where did this... From whence did these things come? So that would be... I'm going to go in there. Um, Ender Pearl. Ender Pearl. Cute. Uh, power bow. Oh my goodness, my bow needs... Is that my regular bow? I thought I had a different bow than that. Uh, I'll take my helmet back and the Elytra. I must have lost my bow. I had one that shot uh, flaming arrows. I don't know what happened to that. Weird. Oops. So we will put the chest, the chest, or not the chest, the, yes, the chest plate in here. We won't be needing that. I might as well take some rockets. Iron I'll put in, actually I'll keep the iron on me. And that will take a couple more blocks because I need to make some, um, I was going to make some lanterns, but that plan changed. So let's just leave that in there for now. Sorry, just sort of talking to myself. I have to stop apologizing because I have to remember that talking to myself is part of the game of streaming. So I'll just put the not so great stuff down here. Thank you. Thank you. Silk touch. Um yes, then you No, shovel. Why did the sword go there? This is Oh, everything's off. Bow. Regular diamond pickaxe. Um Oh, there's the bow. There's the bow. We'll probably need the hoe again. Don't think I'll need flint and steel, so we'll leave that. But we'll take... Oh, we'll need buckets. So we are trying something, and it may be grand. Well, the plan is that it will be grand. Just take all the stuff back, and then I will... Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, Fulmer has... Sorry, I totally missed that. Fulmer has redeemed perfect spot. How long ago was that? That is right now. Alright, Fulmer. Perfect spot it is. So we need to get some stairs and we will place some. And I guess where I am, let's make this the perfect spot. Do I have any on me right now? Um, what stairs do we have? So, actually... Doing this in the wrong order. Fulmer, thank you very much for using your 1,234 1, viewpoints on the perfect spot. It has been a little while, so this is kind of nice to see. Let's see if I have any um, good old stone stairs kicking around. Alright, I'm going to do it over here. We've got stone on us, so we can make a stone stair. We got this. If we can do this, we got this. Uh, let's throw that on the ground for now. Boom! Look at that. The perfect sta perfect spot for some stairs. Fulmer, thank you so much. That's That happened to be right where I was standing, so that is the perfect spot indeed. Nice. Sometimes we can't put them right where we are, so uh, we always have to kind of find a little nook for them. But since this is my area, and that's where I was standing exactly, so it shall stay. Nice. Thank you so much. Uh, all right, let's put stairs. That's right. And put the dirt there. And we shall go grab the other stuff. And now, part of my adventure involves getting some lava. So I forget to have the I have the buckets. Okay, so let's go put back the, all the stones that we took from over here, or most of them. I'm doing a lighting thing. See if I can get this to work the way I want it to. Well, actually, um, Fire Pith already tested it, and he said that it does work, so... Hooray. Let's put that there for now. Um, actually, I think I'll put my Elytra in there for now, which is weird, but we'll do it anyway. That's right, it's lava time. We need buckets and buckets of lava. Well, actually, we're going to test it on this side first. So te technically, we only need one bucket to start, but we got one, two, three... I forget. I think it's eight pillars. No, three along the front, and then one, 
two, three, four. So seven pillars. And how many buckets do we have? 11 empty, 12, 13. Um, you know what? Let's just go make another bucket. And then we'll get 14 because this will do all of the pillars that we have out here right now. Because I'm going to light the interiors um, using lava. Hooray! 12, actually, let's just do... I like having my my water buckets, so we will just do 14 buckets of lava there. Do I? But I don't have 14 spaces free, do I? Let's do that. Actually, uh... Nine. Mr. Escalator. <laughs> What's the name of the goddess? The goddess of the temple? Um, I'm going to go with Asteria because that's actually what the town around it's going to be named. And that's... Uh, whoa. Just give it up. How did you even get out here? Where did you come from? Oh, you probably spawned down there. Yeah, that's not good. So, Asteria. Yeah, that's what I'm going to build a town in front of this. I'm going to do clear out the tree farm that I made. I'm going to make sure I get some more, enough coal from it. And then I'm going to build out... Um, basically, I'm going to probably do this entire area here. And I was thinking I might um, join this river up through here as well. So that it's... While it wouldn't technically be an island because you could get to the bottom of the river. I like the idea of... Um, like this little area of Asteria. <laughs> the area of Asteria being surrounded by a river. I think that'd be kind of neat. Um, do we have to put the elytra away, right? Because we do not want it to burn. And then we need to put some more stone stuff in here because it's not needed for now. What do we need to free up some space? Do, do. Do. I guess I don't really need that boat. You can put that in here for extra, extra end of adventures. So now, do I have enough room? Yes, I have more than. Oops. More than fourteen rows. That's good. I don't know why I have rotten flesh, but I do. Cool. Let's go get some lava, folks. No, I do need some stone because I want to... Or I will get some... Some netherrack. And use that because what I want to do is actually frame off an area of lava. And then just take it from there because I, I hate the way that... Like leaving wa leaving lava running. The look of that just it bugs me so I don't really want to do that. Um, I'm trying to figure out the quickest way down to near lava that's not going to be deadly. I do not believe we have a stairwell that gets down there. <gasps> we do! It's not quite down near lava level, so I probably shouldn't attempt that. I know, how, I know where there is some, so I'm just going to go down that way. It is a little bit a little bit ways off, a little ways off, but I know it to be a safe way to get down there. So we're going to adventure down to where we were last stream, which is down near my um, crimson warped or not the crimson warped giant, the warped giant, the giant warped mushroom. Oh great! So I don't have. Oh wait. Oh, that would just be a single, a single lava source. We don't want to take the single lava sources. We want. We want a bona fide pond of lava. So as I mentioned before, this is my tea sipping excursion. There's a long straight path. And we are able to just point and go. Yeah, not quite low enough there. So onward. So 
I never really quite paid attention to this before, but it's like all of these little stairs steps down. Even there, it's too far down, but bit by bit, these different areas or regions step down a little bit further until he brings us down to water level or lava level, so. It's funny, so my, uh, my Twitch, um, the Twitch title right now is completely a lie. Sorry, Moon Girl, I forgot to say hey there. I did see your, your comment in the chat, but I forgot to say hey, welcome. So, hey there, and welcome. I always have to hop up here, so I might as well take a bit of this out. <laughs> hey! Um, this has been bugging me for a little while. It's just clearly a ghast blast. A goddess dedication, yes. It's funny, though, because uh, until, uh, until Fulmer's asked me, I wasn't quite sure... I hadn't even thought of having a, a goddess for the temple. And so, uh, thankfully, I'd already thought about the name for the town, and the name actually sounds like it could be the name of a goddess, so it works out well. Oh my gosh, we need some potatoes in this face. Down to lava level. Which is dangerous, of course. But it's gotta be done. Actually, I was meaning to come over here and fence off uh, an area of lava once upon a time. Um, actually, a little bit more cheeky than that, and maybe a little bit lamer. It would be a, like, a stair. Yeah. the buckets. Cool. That was neat. Well, I know I feel bad that that's, uh, got taken away, uh, a natural lava pool. How many did we get? Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh, I guess I could have just looked how many buckets I had left. Right, so let's just do 1, 2, 3. I'll just fit those areas in. There we go. Cool. The ambient whisper sounds spooky. Yeah. Does one bucket only hold one shot of lava? Yes, and unfortunately you can't do um, unlimited lava source the same way you can uh, an unlimited water source. Which is why all of this lava over here is running because I ruined it all. Sheesh. And I built this, this bridge. Yeah, I'm using a special a, a mod called Mambience. It's this, um, ambient sound for Minecraft, and it puts a lot of cool different sounds in here, including me running and jumping, and crickets in the morning, crickets late at night, different bird sounds. Quite like it. It adds, it adds an, another level of atmosphere to to um, Twitch, uh, Twitch, Minecraft, which I really enjoy. Is the music sound too loud to some people? Aldabar was on earlier, and he said it sounded loud compared to my voice. So I dropped it down to 70, um, but I'm wondering if I should drop it down to 50.
Um, sure, a little too loud still? Okay. Yeah, <laughs> as the music picks up. There. There's <laughs> that should be a scream. That's funny. It's it's on fifty right now. I'm not sure. You probably there's a bit of a delay. So, um, how does it seem now? Just looking to cause trouble. Yeah, perfect. Thank you all. Um, m like that. Um, all one word, but instead of mambient, it's mambience. Yeah, the evil eye. The evil pig eye. Running, running, running. Jumping all around. The only problem is this. With this is my hunger. Drops right down. <laughs> but I like the I like the fact that the uh, stairs or the um, boots make different sounds when you jump on different materials. Nice. It amuses me. Yeah, I need to take this down one of these days. All right. So why did we just go chase, like run like crazy through the nether? What was the whole point of that? Lava, y'all. This is um, my older son Frostburn came up with an idea. So this is what I was thinking of uh, Fire Pit. I was telling you earlier. I was trying to thinking I might do something like this with the lanterns, which is um. I think it looks kind of neat, but I think the idea that um, Frostburn had might be a little bit better. Um, so I got to go up and t I have to take out this entire wall, I think. No, we need to figure this out first. Right, I was going to do that. So this is, the whole thing is 32, 32 high. Yay, mathing with Steven. So 32 high, minus 2 at the top, 30, minus 2 right there, 28, minus 2 there, 26. Is that right? Yes, 32 to the top, 30, 28, 26. We've got 26 blocks of pillar to work with. So let's just try to figure this out. So I'll go boop. So that's the top. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And one, and two, three, three, four, three, five, three, six. Alright, so I need to figure out a lighting pattern. Or essentially what I'm going to do. Let's just I guess show it quickly. Or do I have any... I don't think I have any andesite stairs on me. So I will have to make some of those. Probably the one type of stair I don't have. I've got stone stairs. That's good. Ready to go. Ready to rock and roll. Um, no andesite right there. Wait, is there andesite up there? No. Well, we certainly have enough stone. It's going to be a mix of andesite stairs and stone stairs at the bottom. Soul stairs. Um, well, andesite. We'll just take that. We're going to make a pile of andesite stairs because we need them. No, wait. Let's not do this. There we go. Because we've got the stone cutter uh, right there. Oh, uh, polished andesite stair? That's not what I wanted. Interesting, though. 
because I was thinking about using that somewhere else. I'll just hang on to that. I thought that was regular andesite. I was not paying attention. Alright, try this again. Oh, I see. It's actually in there in the recipe, so you don't have to go through the trouble. Well, that's cool. Cool. Alright. Alright, so, 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 pillars, um, basically I was thinking, or a combination of what I was thinking and Frostburn was thinking, that's just for now, so, I need to figure out the pattern, but I'm going to just pretend that this is lava pouring down from the top for now, um, I don't actually have the blocks I thought I had on. Alright, well I will just do actual lava for now then. Hopefully that does not involve me dying. Uh, that is in the wrong spot. So I go there, and there, and then a bucket of lava will go We have a cosmic raid. Woohoo! Cosmic is raiding. That's awesome. Welcome, everyone. Uh, actually, let's just let's take a moment and let, welcome the raiders in. And um, then we will do what we were about to do. So we got a cosmic raid. Welcome, everyone. Good to see you here. So I was happy that I was able to... Um... <laughs> you probably already know me already. Yes. It's a lot of lava, indeed. Looking to make Alistair proud today, so... Welcome everyone on Cosmic's Raid. Cosmic, thank you so, so much. I'm so happy I was able to be of um, a huge help to you in getting your uh, Elytra. <laughs> Kidding, obviously. Very happy that you're able to uh, grab that. That was super exciting. Um, and you did it all on your own. So you didn't... And as far as I could tell, because I was popping in and out, you didn't die at all either, right? You actually managed to get in there. In and out. Without death. Am I correct? All right, well, just for those of you who may not know me, coming in with Cosmic, I know we have a lot of the, the usual suspects in both our both of our streams, but my name is Steven ESC, and I am also a streamer, a Minecraft streamer on The Citadel with Cosmic. So, um, yeah. Today we're working on... Couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> That's right. No death. Sweet. That's awesome. Congratulations. I have never not... I don't think I have... I was going to say I've never not died in the nether, which is horrible English, but I think it's true. Um, let's just do this for now. Okay. Actually, let's see if I can... See if I can manage to do this without excessive dying. Well, we don't want any dying. Um... Put that there, that there. So essentially, the thought was to have it look like this to a degree. So we're going to light the insides by doing this. So the plan is, um, so it'll be more noticeable at nighttime. So you won't actually be able to see. Um, give me a second, I gotta go relax and unclench all of my, <laughs> no kidding. It's almost like saying I didn't do no no nothing. That's right, it's true. I did not not do nothing. So this is essentially the, uh, the idea that uh, Frostburn had. Since we've got the fence going up, um, or the wall, I should say, essentially, the I don't know if I mind that though. I might make it go all the way up. No worry, Hunter Triple Five. Appreciate you coming over with the uh with the oh my goodness, what's it called? Thank you for coming over with the raid. Um and wholeheartedly understand if you can't stay. So thank you very much for popping in. Have a wonderful rest of the day. 
So this is basically what it's going to be all the way up. Um, I don't know if it, I don't think it bothers bothers me that. Um, I'll have to see, because right now this wall connects all the way up here, which I like. But I don't, don't know if that will bother me if it doesn't. I think that might look cool all the way up there. Because at a you know at a quick glance it still looks fine. It's just going to be glowing. So that's going to be my plan actually. So let's let's just try that. Oops, let's get back up there. Which means I need to walk over here. I get it? No, I'm gonna go back over here. Gosh darn it. And I get the bucket. There we go. So, I need to go to the top and remove all kinds of stuff. So I realize this is me undoing a lot of, ooh, nice. Undoing a lot of what I've done already, but I think in the end it's gonna be super cool for it. Uh, look very cool. Um, after all the end, all of, after all the undoing and redoing. So let's put the lava here. No, let's put the lava here. Do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. Wait. Just be 14 of them. One, two, six, seven. Oh, there, I'm gonna send my hopper. Silliness. Okay, so that's cool. They're all where they're supposed to be. That's good. And I don't think I'm gonna need these lanterns because I've got a change. I've had a change of heart. Um, Wait, do I have the fences on me still? I do not, so I'll have to get the fence replacement. So for now, I'm going to go up to the very top here and then dig my way down and take out basically <laughs> take out half of each pillar after all of this building i'm going to go full destructive here um, and since we've covered this up with snow like a smart human we are a lurk in one channel and unlurk in another that's right this is the way. All right. Is this right? Okay, yeah, that's good. We are... So we must be inside... That might be exactly right. Can I see the pillar from here? Am I going to regret going over to the edge like this? All right, so this is... This is exactly in line with the pillar. That's good. Which means it's that one, that one, that one, and that one. No. Uh, I need to confirm that. One moment, please. Canadian like Joel? Indeed, I am. This looks like this is in line with post one two. So I wasn't over far enough. So it should be this. So I feel actually, let's just take. Oh, I'm not centered. Shoot, which means I took out one of the stairs, didn't I? Oh no, that's uh, that's incorrect. I don't want to take those out, but that's not all bad. So I'll do this, and then it is going to be... Well, how did I mess that up? Joel is good peoples. And he likes pancakes. <laughs> Actually, um, we shall go all the way down. I am going to have to take down the corner ones. You followed the Stephen ESC on the Twitters. Thank you kindly, Rabelais. Much appreciated. 
you know what? I apologize. I did not say hello to those who came over in the raid. That was uh, an oversight on my part. Who all came over? Uh, we had... Hunter Triple Five who came in and bowed out, which is good. True Purple, hello. Hello, Dark Poet and Shepherd. Good to see you. Um, Zero Fox, hello, hello. And we have uh, Lost Decoy Found. Thank you for coming by. And Fulmers was here already. That's cool. Awesome. And then Rabelais as well. And Shepherd, hello there. So I apologize. I did not do a good job of welcoming everyone back then. Unkind of me. Unkind. My mind, I guess, was just on the project trying to figure this out. So here we are here, which means we need to face this way. I don't know how far we down, how, how far down we are. I guess that would be my answer. Okay. Probably don't need to go down another half, or it's probably another eight blocks, right? Not very Canadian of me at all. You are correct. I have, I have my my Canadian card has been revoked for lack of politeness. All right, cool. All right, so we got that one entirely hollowed out. I am um, I'm hollowing out the pillar, for I am doing something with lava to light the interior. See if I can get this done before it's night time. I need to take out this one. I can get this uh line this up properly uh, these are all going to get replaced with stairs oh what did I miss uh separate turtle accounts for streaming I was trying to figure that out myself. I mean, I'm not very good on Twitter anyway. I don't post a whole, whole lot. So most of what I've been posting lately has been streaming related anyhow. So, um, I'm still not sure what I want to do. I'm still not sure what I want to be when I grow up. And you'll find the Tims, pretty much. There are two within walking distance from our house. Three, actually, if you count the one in the ferry terminal. Okay, so we've got that entirely hollowed out now. That looks super odd. But, um, no, I don't want to do that. Inside stairs. Do I only have the one? I do not. I just misplaced them. Okay. So we'll do that. And is this how you do it? Oh my goodness. Love it. Hmm. I'm not sure I'm going to do this. We'll probably have to build this up bit by bit. One side at a time. I am not as, uh, as uh, confident a builder as the Joel. I'll just have to build the, uh, the center column here up as I go. It should be fine because I've got plenty of cobble and then I will just come right back down afterwards. gotta figure it out. No problemo. Voodoo Donuts is good. 
It is good, actually. We've got there's an uh, Vandal Donuts as well, uh, um, sort of like a a local hipster donut shop here. That's quite good. Donuts are expensive, but they're uh, crazy yummy. <laughs> lost do lost decoy. Couldn't resist but chime in. Talk about the voodoo donuts. <laughs> that and like that this is gonna take less time than I thought it would which is cool so I love it when ideas like this come together so it's just it was cool just my son made the suggestion at the dinner table I was like that sounds awesome what if we do this? And then what if we do this turns into like, oh yeah, cool, what if we do that? And then just, I think this idea is sound. I mean, we'll find it shortly, but like the, uh, on paper, sounds perfect. That's awesome, and that's exactly where we needed to stop. Beautiful. Oh my goodness, it's like we planned it or something. Okay, so then we can go, uh, mad skills, angry skills. <laughs> yes, it is. Fun fact, you can buy five gallon pail of Dale donuts for $5 US. $5 US, that's like $73 Canadian. That's not bad. Kidding. It's probably, it might be about 650 Canadian these days. I think ish all right I'm excited for this yeah that is dangerous day olds are still good no complaints about day olds oh wait wait okay double weight no elytra Good thing we checked. I was about to fly down the stairs. Ha ha ha. Yeah, two to one was rough. And once upon the time, the Canadian dollar was higher than the US dollar. I do not, I'm not old enough to remember those days, but. Um, and then we put the lava over here. So let's go get a lava. One, one luxurious pail of lava. Ah, ah, ah. La lava. We will, we, we joke, la lava. <laughs> like, spelled like llama. And fun fact, we looked it up. French for llama is llama. French for the llama is le llama. <laughs> Alright, so we should be good with just doing this. Boop. I guess technically we didn't need to hollow this side out. We could have left it as is. Which I might... I may actually fill that back in. No, wait, this is not correct. We need to, so this is too high, which means we would need to start this, um, there. Yes. All right. So now we have, we should have a glowing pillar. Neat.
And Frostburn, I'm not sure if you're watching, but like from this angle, it still looks like the pillar that I had intended, even though it's not connected the entire way. When you look at this side, you can't tell that it's not connected. And when you look at this side, you can't tell it's not connected. So all in all, it does a pretty good job of... So th this is now a standalone beam, which, you know, knowing that bugs me a little bit. At the same time, having it glow evenly all the way up, that looks pretty... Pretty nice. Now I just need to wait until nighttime. Be able to appreciate that. Oi, Mr. ESC, how are ya? CJ, CJ, welcome to the chat. Good to see ya, buddy. Mate, that's what I should have said. Wait, it should attach to the walls. Uh, yes, but I didn't do the... I didn't, um... I didn't do it that way. I just did. It, it's, it doesn't do it because the stairs are... You're dying. <laughs> so it's it, because it's um it's the stairs. So it doesn't join on those. Can that be a channel point? <laughs> Maybe. I might have to work on that a little bit. No joking. Um... Well, I could. Okay, on the next one, let's try, um... Well, what do we think? Do we like seeing the lava? Every two? Is that good? Or I can space it out more. I'm doing all right, Mr. CJ. Thank you very much. Or Mr. Williams, I guess, I should say. Be formal. Doing well, thank you. French accent redemption. <laughs> Indeed, how are we all this evening? So let's be careful. Mr. Williams was my father. Fair enough, fair enough. You'd actually like to see more lava. <laughs> well, fantastic, then we will keep it that way. All right, now what I can't remember is, I think it's six in between. Ugh. There we go, unintentional, unintentionally yeets a tool. Would that's, that's a bingo redemption, so remember that. I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So in line with this. should be do, 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 do. yay we found the cobblestone hooray now this one because it's inward facing all of these are coming out I don't think that one does no no one does not so we're just going to uh Gain all kinds of resources again. Actually, it's probably easier if I just... Um, oh, we need to go... Check out the pillar. Oh, of course there's a creeper. Why wouldn't there be a creeper? Oh, uh, why? <laughs> it's like bob and weave, bob and weave. Fuck those arrows because they are uh, they are valuable. Okay, still so we have to, we want to be a little bit careful, but that's basically what that pillar is going to look like. Creeper's going to creep. That's right. So that pillar is going to glow like that, and then I'm going to do I'm going to hollow out. Because that's just going to be the corner on that one because it's the corner pillar and I'm only going to light at the inside and so I'm taking out this side, that one, here, here, and here and so that they're all going to be gl glowing from the pillar. It's pretty snazzy, eh? Not disappointed at all. Thanks, Rabelais. 
Let's go back up here. And I'll just take it one at a time. Thank you. Me too. Yeah, and it was, uh... Oh my goodness. Seriously. Hopefully they don't decide to come down here. You do the same thing with your triumphal arch? Oh, cool. Let's just do this. Damage was saying directly translated. Um, aims well, but hits badly. <laughs> I like that. Let's just take the outside ones down first. That seems to be the smartest. I guess the uh, it would be pretty good for me as well, except for the fact that I don't think I aim well. Oops, food. I think for me, it's like aims poorly and hits accordingly. I have a new streamer name for Steven. What was that? Katniss Everstare. <laughs> nice. Hey, man made. Welcome back. Good to see you. Oops. Indeed, chat, how are we this evening? Inquiring minds, aka myself, and man made would like to know. Other than Igmund? Elkhorn arrives! Hello, Elkhorn. Good to see you. Where is Igmund? Uh, Igmund is always at the ready, just not here at the moment. I am. Want to see what we decided over dinner? Look at this. We got stairs. It's always Tuesday. So essentially we're going to have it like... So the inside of the pillars are going to glow at nighttime. Pretty great. So I only did the corner on that it's one because Tuesday. it... Is it already? Oh my goodness. Thank you, Moon Girl, for using your 2,000 viewpoints on... It's Igman. No. Tuesday's Igman. No. Igman's child. Or maybe, but no. It's Tuesday. One sec. Let's get the timer ready. And hopefully a creeper doesn't walk up and then try to kiss me on the face because that never ends well and it's uncomfortable. Um, timer. Go. Okie dokie. So... The whole thing started when my younger son said I should light the pillars on the inside to make it glow at night time. And I didn't want to make it look super obvious, but I really liked the idea. Speaking of Tuesday, can you refresh me on what this newfangled stream schedule is? Ah yes, it is now, it is mostly the same as before, except for Thursday now. So it is Tuesday, 7.30 Atlantic until 10. And now Thursday, same time instead of Friday. And then Sunday morning at 10, um, um, 10 o'clock. Yes, 10 o'clock in the morning, Atlantic Daylight Savings Time. And so it is just a way to, because at the end of a busy week, on a Friday, I always felt like, whoo, I really need to put my feet up and then drink back a good coconut. But we didn't have any coconut, so I couldn't do that. But also... At the end of a busy work week, I just had to then go right into streaming, and so it did not feel like a restful time for my brain. And so, I moved the Friday to Thursday, and now Fridays are magnificent. Magical. They're so magical, you pronounce the hard G, so they're magical. So good. Oof, that hurt my bunion. But so, since these pillars have a face 
or a side that faces the interior space I am now doing an entire side so two corners essentially so it's going to be extra snazzy so I'm going to do that to all the pillars over here and all the pillars on the other side and then I have lava that pours down in the inside and makes it look oh so pretty so it's good well it sounds on the corner test it worked perfectly and so I'm hoping that on the full face one it'll work perfectly here Exact. oh that's right Pizza is Friday is pizza and movie night now. Which is fantastic. And that is the timer this Tuesday. Thank you so much, Moon Girl, for using your point views. No, your viewpoints. Channel points. I'm... There's something behind me. Should I be worried? I wonder if it'll get me. Probably. I should not do that. Yes, it would have reached me and um Hugged me with a warm, fiery hug. Or Marvel Knight. Yes, it's usually Marvel Knight, but that's not the thing right now. And I believe when Yoki's... Yoki? <laughs> when Yoki's... Oh, that's enough. I'm done with the voice. What am I doing? Cool. All right. Sorry. Thank you, Moon Girl, for using your 2,000 viewpoints on Tuesday's Child. Totally got in the, <laughs> in the zone there, and I just kept doing it. So apparently Loki is going to be... Um, Yoki, exactly. Loki is going to be Wednesday nights, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it is six. However, since I stream, or since Frostburn streams Wednesday nights, we may still keep it as a Friday night thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, which means pillar on seven. We just watched Shadow and Bone. Yeah, it's quite good. I know there are some people who, uh, I know it's, it wasn't Joel's favorite show, and I've heard people on site online, uh, or read that people find it very cliche, but I mean, I get it. They're like the typical love triangle and stuff like that. So there wasn't, it's not without its cliches, but overall I quite enjoyed it. To each their own. Good, good. And then part of the reason I liked it because it felt very, um, parts of it that felt very Avatar The Last Airbender. It is like it's it's definitely um, it's based on a a young adult novel, so it's it's not without its you know YA cliche type things, but still um, kind of still found it thoroughly entertaining. We are yes. And I think as Joel said, his one of his biggest problems is you know is everyone's in their. 20, 20s or whatever and everyone's good looking and it's like but that's your typical it's your typical TV show anyway um the nevers I don't know what the nevers is I feel like I should but I do not yeah I did feel very well with the nevers good And they had one scene that was getting a little bit um, romantically heated between two people, and there was a clear steampunk in the, oh, HBO. I wish we had HBO. You can only get that as part of uh, Crave TV up here, as an add-on to Crave TV up here in Canada, which unfortunately means you buy Crave for like 15 bucks or whatever it is, and then HBO is like an extra 10 or $15 on top of that. So that's right, Hello Darkness, my old friend. Indeed. But I guess what I was saying is like there was a scene that was getting a little bit heated romantically between two characters and there was a clear a clear asking for consent moment in it, which I thought was a really cool thing to, to show in a TV show because like it's probably the first time I saw it. It was really uh, I think an important thing to include i mean i know you're there's going to be some there are going to be some people who say it just felt like a very hit you over the head moment like yes we get it you're talking about it but like that was what it should be like it should be a hit you over the head obvious asking Ooh, that was almost dangerous This is the last one coming down, so this should be fine. I'm just going to take that out now. So Joel wants actors in their 80s and ugly. 
Well, I think he would like a, mi <laughs> a mix. Well, if you ever watch... Um, one of the things I like about some British shows is that you have people that are attractive, but they're not... They're not model attractive. A lot of North American shows, you could easily take any one of those people and stick them in a magazine spread and they could probably be a model. So yeah, that's that's how the glow looks. And so that glow is going to happen on the face of all of these pillars now. Be nice. I know, I figured you knew, but just, uh, basically, <laughs> basically you're not wrong. All right, so that, oh no, now I need to build back up. So do I have the appropriate amount of stairs on me? I have some stairs on me. Oh no, did I do all of those stairs? Oh, that's not cool, Steven. I did all those stairs as andesite, which is not at all what I wanted to do. Darn it! I wanted andesite at the bottom and then stone stairs for the rest of them. TV ugly where they're still the prettiest person. <laughs> That's right. I have to undo some of the doing that I did. Right, that's gone now. What are we doing, Steven? Well, we planned poorly, so... Oh, what did I miss, Elkhorn? You're almost older. <laughs> nice. Um... We need to come down from here. I probably have to wait or that's going to burn me, isn't it? Uh, I guess not. I have to wait till it goes all the way down anyway because I need to put cobblestone. Alright, let's just let it do its thing. And then we will come back. Because they messed it up. Come back and fix it later. So Andy Sight stairs go there's, there's. There's and there's. Uh, and we'll do that. Oh, can I do that here? Probably not. Oh yeah, cool. Even though it's not going to touch, it works. Love it. Actually, let's go a bit closer. Let's do this one. I can get that after. That's fine. I can still hear lava over there. I guess I can't quite do that on the side of there. That's a drag. All right, so I guess you do have to come down there, Lantern. Oh, no, wait, I could do these ones. Okay, cool. Oh, nope, nope, nope. All right, now uh, like this. Excellent. All right, cool. That'll work. Oh my goodness. That's going to be the uh, the death of me. Wait. Problem solved. 
that way we can just continue to build up here. And then if I fall off, I'm not going to die. Oh, I'm doing it again. Why andesite stairs all the way up, Steven? I just get into a pattern, that's why. It's annoying. Boring, no risks. <laughs> oh, tough crowd. I guess I suppose I am boring. Boring, Steven. Boring. I want to do that, that. Yeah, this would be good. No. There we go. Alright. And I'll do this again. Sorry that I've made this far less interesting for you all. Although I could. I could take that out. Get a little more exciting. File that under why not. Let's do that. That. And that. Oh, I'm far enough away now. I'll leave it. The next time I won't. We'll make it interesting next time. Um, so I finished watching the uh, TV series Jupiter's Legacy last night. I found it uh, pretty interesting. Still processing it. I, I, I enjoyed it. I don't have any complaints about it offhand. I guess my only complaint is that the character it was there were two different timelines. I thought they did a really good job of bouncing back and forth between the two timelines. But they had the same character the same actors for two timelines, and um I don't know that the uh the makeup that made them older was always the best. And I know it's easy for me to sit here and say that, but it's because I, I know it's probably not easy to do. But it was, uh, I think that was the only thing that took me out of, like, uh, I guess, well, the, uh, the mini reality they had going on for me. Otherwise, pretty cool show. That and then we're almost done there. That's exciting. Actually, we are almost out of stairs. Which is fantastic. Uh, Jupiter's Legacy. Oh my goodness. Near Dearth Experience. All right, now that we're down here, let's uh, let's heed the request to make it uh, a little bit more. Um, a little bit more exciting for viewers. Yeah, it worked. That's right. But since we want to include some entertainment value, we have since removed it. Oops. Do you have any obsidian? Or not obsidian, andesite. Am I low on andesite? I must be. I thought I still had more of it. Oh, here. Right there it is. Andesite. Andesite. Stone, 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 stone. We're going to turn all those stones into stairs. Well, actually, we should say we're just going to turn. Two stacks of stairs, and then we'll do. 
Um, probably two stacks of anesthetic stairs. If we can spare it. Uh, which looks like we can. Cool. Alright, we do not need the snowballs. The snowballs can say goodbye. There we go. Oh, right, now I need to go all the way back up there. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it, all the heck. Oh, looks like it's getting late. Eek. And then go like that. That, that, and like so. And I should just finish it off right here. So one, two, three, four. Beautiful. Beautiful. You look lovely. And that, that, and... Oh, why, Steven? Um, oh, yes. I guess to talk a little bit more about Jupiter's Legacy... It is a, uh, a show basically that has follows a superhero family, and it's a uh, it has the uh, basically the origin story of the the parents and how they get the superpowers, and then it talks about how you know they live by this code code in the old days, and now that the younger kids are coming up with superpowers, you know they're struggling with what that means for them. So it's it's pretty good. No, I can't remember. I took out... Right, I need to go back up there and take down the, um... The interiors there. I need to take those lamps down. Uh, it's a bit of a, a shame. I did like the way they started to look, but now they just don't fit. Let's take all the lamps down now that we're doing this. All the lamps! Actually, you know what? It's probably not a bad idea to have things lit this time of day. So let's just leave them as so for now. And... I needed more andesite fence posts, but I don't remember where I put them. No, stone brick. They're not fence posts, but walls. Cool. Oh, sorry. Um, do chat and or Mr. Escalator watch anime? I do watch it sometimes. I haven't watched it in a while. Um, been really wanting to, I guess been thinking about Naruto because I haven't seen it and it's like from what I understand one of these one of these sort of must see ones over the like at some point and so I think that's one of the things I'm going to uh, add to my list and embrace the next little while so cool all right let's go up and uh, light this up Akira yeah I've seen that been a long time though actually lurking a little feeling surprisingly t feeling unsurprisingly tired you mean <laughs> no worries at all cosmic I totally understand I'm surprised you're not asleep already well part of me is surprised you're not asleep already but part of me can appreciate the fact that you're probably buzzing a little bit from it all midnight oil burnt that's right It worked! Can we do that now? Cool. Let's go check this out. I actually wish it were light time right now so we could see, um, see it being lit up real time. Mm, 
need So cool. I am not disappointed with that at all. Because I mean, you'll be able to see the lava in all of the pillars at some point, but it's not always, always visible. I think that's cool. Frostburn, thank you very much for the idea. Like, and like I said, even though those corner walls don't actually touch, you can't really tell a whole lot unless you go up and look at it. Like seeing the preteen boys in the neighborhood run around. Like... Yeah, <laughs> true. <laughs> you enjoyed Naruto very much. Be very. I'll be wary, wary of filler episodes. Gotcha. Yeah, not a huge fan of filler episodes, but I understand that is uh, a thing sometimes. Arms behind them, yeah. Just basically asking to trip and bang their face on the ground. I'm not wishing that on anybody, but it's basically. That's what's gonna happen if you're not careful, children's. And then we go up like. Take these all down, unfortunately, and then we'll build, build them back up with the, uh, the stone. Yep. Like it just feels like it's bound to happen. They're just tempting fate. I would not wish that on anyone. It's like, you know that without having ha running without having your hands ready to protect you is just sort of saying, I wonder what the quickest way to injure my face while running would be. Oh, that's that. Specifically that right there. Um, that. And then do, 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 do. Now I've got a rhythm for this. It's going to be pretty quick to build it back up, which is cool. Right there. I don't need all this skin in my chin. Right <laughs> exactly. Well, if that's the case, have fun. Run at, run away, children, run away. First season of Naruto, and the third are the last third are fillers. Yeah, that's one of the things I loved about um, Avatar: The Last Airbender. They had some filler episodes, but even their filler episodes felt like they had substance to them. It wasn't just done for the sake of being done. It's like, oh, we've got you know eight episodes we need to kill because. That's what the budget allowed for this year, so we've got to do it. Oh, what did I mess up? Yeah, I did mess that up. Wait, I messed that up a little while ago. Oh. Yeah, it was the worst ever. It almost made me write a letter to DreamWorks. Don't do it! So how did I mess this up here? Or did I mess it up? Looks even with me space there, but did I mess up this side then? What? I don't understand. It all looks good to go. But it feels like it's all been messed up at the top. It is, yeah. I mean, the only thing I can think of is if they had a story arc planned for a certain number of episodes, and then somebody came and said, oh, the contract is actually for this many episodes, not that many. And suddenly you're going, oh, that's just... 
Oh, okay. I see what I did. Yay, Steven. And there. So I was right. I just totally misread what I was doing. No worries. Now we're good. Back to where we wanted to be. So now we go back down. Then go back up. Fill it with lava. Then we have two. Two. Two wonderfully warm and bright pillars. Ah, ah, ah. Get a nice rhythm going. Schmancy. Um, let's do... Andesite and Andesite. Can't remember what they were, but that sounds good to me. And then we'll do... Andesite Stair. Fantastico. Pick up this carnage. Nice. Noise, I say. Noise. Oh, wait. I have no lava. Not noise. Not the lava box. We'll just grab a couple because we're gonna going to eventually need a couple. Oh. Uh, that up there. I guess we don't need that up there either. However. Really, did I block that off entirely? Like, poor planning? Oh! Apparently that one's already... Oh, this is the one I was wanted to go to. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! We then need to... reach down there. Fill this up. And then light... this bad boy up right... there. Whoosh, double whoosh. Yep. I know this is not going to light up the area completely, but I love the way this is looking. It's too bad Alistair's not here. I do believe it would garner uh, his, uh, his lava seal of approval. Yep. Oh, we wanted to, uh, right. Firefifth mentioned seeing, uh, it'd be cool to see what this looked like glowing from afar, so let's just do that. Entire inside of the tower, and the entire inside of the monument is going to be lit at nighttime like that. I still need to figure out the floor. I'm not entirely happy with that, which is why I started working on the pillar. Yeah, you're right, Firepith. So this is like, I, I, again, Firepith, thank you for the idea of lighting up the pillars, and thank you, Frostburn, for uh, the idea of lighting up the interior, and thanks, Brain, for coming up with the idea of pouring lava down. Hmm. Uh, so far, so close, I mean. Uh, oh. We need to get some sleep. Can I just go to bed in here, or are there any baddies in there? Should be lit, lit well enough, but... Yeah, it is. Hopefully a creeper doesn't come along and, uh, kill me. Oh, Fulmer's what did I miss? Looks good. Thank you very much. No, I, one of my favorite things is 
burning skeletons. Basically because it's like free bones. Free bones and arrows. Ah! Yep, free arrows. Probably have a free arrow in the back of my in the back of my leg. Oops, and that was those are not my arrows. What is that? Rogue. Rogue what? Rogue Wonderlana. <laughs> uh, Rogui. Right, now we're on to the next. I was like, what are we doing now? On to the next pillar. <laughs> that was close enough. Let's change it to Wonder. Wonderlana. It's fantastic. Can do this one. Um, is that correct? I suppose it would be. Oh, me, I forgot about my tea. Okay, that is the right height because that is the stairs. Good, good. Let's take that down. Spin around until we make ourselves dizzy. No, what did we do? What did we decide? It was smarter to do them one column at a time, or quicker, I should say. Who knows about smarter? No, it's not necessarily quicker because then I have to go back up. I'm so fickle. Let's just change our minds multiple times. So this does take longer per level, but it just means I don't have to go up and down. Which is always good. So has anybody been watching the new uh, animated Star Wars show? I think I heard some people were pretty excited for that. We're not really a Star Wars family per se. I mean, I enjoy the movies, and but I haven't seen any of the animated shows yet. So when I first heard the Bad Batch was coming out, I thought it was going to be, um, I guess, similar world to the the Mandalorian. So I didn't really check it out until it came out and I saw it. Oh, wait. What's my silk touch? I was wondering why it was coming up cobblestone. So I was a little bit surprised by the um, animated, the fact that it was animated, but that's just because I didn't do my homework and check it out beforehand. I've heard those shows are pretty good, but I guess I'm not as much of a, f not enough of a Star Wars fan to go seeking it out. I guess there are other things that I'd be interested in watching. Do you have the sniper dual achievement in this world? Kill a skeleton with an arrow for more than 50 meters? I don't know. Um, how would I find that one out? Sniper duel, yep. Uh, no, I don't have it. Oh, from 50 blocks away. I gotta work on that then. Thank you for the reminder, actually. That's one of the things I want to do in my uh, my new single player world when I started up, is uh, get all of the achievements. I should try to do that on the Citadel as well. It's, it never seems like a priority thing to do when building other things, but I should definitely keep that in mind. Appreciate the question slash uh, jog of the memory. So many materials. Okay, sounds good, Moon Girl. Appreciate it. Take that down. We'll go down from here. 
So many things that I need to put away. Oh, I just put all this... Uh, put the cobblestone away because that's less useful. I don't really need any stone right now. I'm going to that because the netherrack because it's quick to build with. Oh! Dark in my office. Hold on one sec, folks. Close the blinds and turn on the light. Alright. Cool. And then now let's go pick up all of these resources. Oh, thanks for popping by, CJ. Good to see you. And, um, yeah. Take care of yourself, and we'll be seeing you in chat or stream somewhere soon. I am sure of it. And if anyone doesn't follow CJ already, can somebody give uh, a shout out for CJ? Because this guy is a good guy, and he does some very cool stuff in his stream, so definitely worth checking it out. Um. Or uh, I guess we don't have a moderator in. Let's just do that here. Myself. C. J. Oops. Almost forgot the RV. DJ RV Williams. Cool. We'll do that that and that and then we'll switch to the other stairs the other Without having to move left or right, able to get all of the stairs placed, which is nice. Uh, that's incorrect. Oops, and then of course I moved, so that might have messed me up. Hopefully not. I'll go right there. Hopefully good. Yeah, they did mess me up. Gosh darn, Steven, why'd you have to ruin a good thing? No. Incorrect Amundo. messed it up anyway. So we'll just continue. Sorry, I'm getting a little bit quiet as we get into the details and the worry of falling off. So this is my usual state of mind. Or my usual, I guess, mode to slip into when fear of falling off. When the fear of falling off is real. Would help if I wasn't in the block I'm trying to play something on. Uh, unhappy face. Um, and I don't have anything to make a crafting table right here, so then I means I need to uh, cleverly fall down and work my way back up. Not the end of the world, just a drag. Um. Uh oh, what did I do there? Huh? So I totally botched that one. That's not good. Is it salvageable is the question? Looks like it. Which means I need to place um there. And there. Cool. 
No need to panic, everybody. We're good. We're good. Mm, what's that? Nope. Like that. And we reached the point where it's almost bedtime again, so let's go get some, uh, get a nap going. Boing, boing. Oof. And whilst sleeping, we'll drink our tea like usual. Good tea. We need some more stone stairs. Parkour. Um, and I don't have enough stone on me, which means I should have totally brought some with me. Uh, we'll do that and that. How are we for candlestick stairs? Oh, we're good. Cool. I feel like I have more stone on me, but I guess I do not. That's fine. We'll get some more eventually. I mean, we'll get some stone from taking down the outside walls of the other pillars, too. So, um, probably best to go with the top and come down at this point because we made it high enough up there that. Excuse me. Made it high enough up there that it doesn't make any point to build up to it. Before I say that, of course, I may, and I may drop to my death, so we'll have to see. Bends over cautiously. Oh, that's good. Oof. Oof. So we do that. And they're back into action, folks. We are good. We're good. Two more at the top. Lovely. Lovely. Do, do, do. And like that. Like that. We can reach over there. We can. Good. All right, I think we got what we need. So with the whole Minecraft music thing, I do like it. I'm not sure how I feel about it all the time. I almost, oh my goodness. I'm not paying attention. Part of me feels like I like the other music on the whole. There's part of me that feels like, oh, have a good night. Have a great stream. Thank you very much, Fomers, for popping by. Good to have you here. Have yourself a wonderful rest of your day, and we'll hopefully see you again soon. Um, sort of bugs me that I have the back of it like the pillar pillars entirely hollow but i don't know why it, sh it does it doesn't feel like it should nobody's gonna know <laughs> nice fire pit fare thee well formers fare thee well all right so now we've got um the lava on us let's go fill that in fill it in shall we Lava in hand, ready to pour. 
can look at that. It doesn't really matter what corner as long as we do it. Oh, come on. Why you gotta be like that? Well, missing the light show. Hey Sosa, welcome to the chat. Good to see you. Just in time for the uh, the lighting of this pillar. The lava pours down the inside. I guess I should say the tail end of the lighting of this pillar. Nice. Yeah, this is just gonna look. Su By the time this is all done, it's gonna look super cool on the uh, in interior at nighttime. This is the next one we're going to do. Might as well, uh... Let's do this. Let's take... Let's take the bottom layer out so that we know. So that we know when we reach the bottom, we'll drop an extra block. How are you this evening, Sosa? Or Sosa? Glad you could make it in. I do not need these snowballs, so let's just act like a giant child and Yeah, what I wish it would do is automatically grab the other ones. I love the sound. Alright, so now we need to... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Full anyway. Yep, probably right about there. Which is good. Take out the cobblestone, and that's probably where we want to start doing this. Tis indeed. Digging away, digging away. Part of me was, uh, I'm happy that we figured out something that's going to make these pillars look awesome. It's just, it feels like almost the, uh, <laughs> some of the pillars I've built and rebuilt a couple of times. So there's part of me that just wishes these pillars were done. If I could just make up my mind. I guess in reality, I don't need to... I don't need to dig these out. Hmm. Oh well, we've been doing it for the other ones, so we'll just continue to do it. But I'm, uh, I'm fickle. I may change my mind and decide to go back in and fill half of these up because why not? But you know what? I probably will. So let's just... I'll, go, I'll do it afterwards, but I'm just going to stop taking down the entire thing. We'll just take down the front part because that's all that's needed. Place all of these bad baddies with some stairs. There we go. Here we go. 
have reached the bottom. Excellent. Grab all these resources so they don't go to waste. Oops. Time of day is at 4 to 2 seconds. Very nice, very nice. And the question again, do I have enough stone stone stairs? No, antique stairs, antique stairs. Probably not enough stone stairs. I'll make some stone stairs quickly and then um, a look, look, quick look at what the interior looks like all lit up. Nice and pretty like. Another glimpse of what this is going to look like when done. Ah, of course, why would, why wouldn't you just let me have a moment? Wow. The rare time that Steven actually gets both shots off accurately. Rare occasion. Cool, so let's um let's do this. And do that one. Thanks, Cosmic. Very happy with the way that it turned out. So. Really appreciate that. Oh, we've just pulled the first strawberries of the season from the garden. Nice. I'm not, I don't like, I know it may be weird to hear, but I'm not someone who likes a lot of fruit. Just the texture of them is a little bit not my thing. Um, but strawberries, fresh strawberries, yeah. They are the good. that. Oh, who's popping out? Can head out for now, Firepit? Yeah, fair enough. No worries. Have yourself a good evening and I will be um, literally seeing you later. Thank you very much for popping by, Firepit. And as Joel likes to say, take it easy. If I turn my head, I can see them. Or who is there's? Oh, uh, Firepith's one of my uh, my sons. <laughs> He's downstairs. I thought. Uh, apologies for the, uh, the confusion there. I thought that was semi common common knowledge. Oops, on the stream now. Oh my goodness, that sounded amazing. I don't know why I did this. I did not go high enough. <laughs> Rebele has found his happy place. And the world, Rebele, is both happy for you and envious of you. done this one too sweet cool 
Let's look again. No worries at all. No worries at all. Realize it's one of those streams where I'm not saying a whole whole lot just because I'm focusing on the details. Thanks, Travel A. I, I'm my sons often come up with really good ideas, so it's it's I love it when you know it's kind of a these ended up being a bit of a joint idea between all of us, and they're turning out um, as well as I could have hoped. Quite happy with them. I do need to take these down, no matter what. But I forgot I have to. F I wanted to fill in the other ones as well. So I'll do that, and then this, and this, and then we'll go to the top. Oh, we are lavaless, le lavaless. Let's get some lava. We'll go to the top. Come and get me. Yeah, that's right. I'm sunproof. And apparently a jerk. <laughs> Do you like the Minecraft music? Uh, it's straight from the game. Uh, someone in Joel's uh, Discord actually posted, I forget who it was, they posted a link to a mod that just plays the music Oops. Um, non-stop it's pretty great mm-hmm very convenient um, oh I am at a stone that is not what I wanted it's all right though um, I will just have to go get some for next time I am up here I guess that's what happens when I use. That's what happens when I use all my uh, all my stone on on stairs. Let's see it late. You see additional music to the soundtrack at some point. Yeah, I think that's it's 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 interesting that you say that because I have been finding it a little bit repetitive. And I think it's probably because it's. Well, I know for a fact it's not meant to be played all the time, uh, non-stop, so it just probably seems repetitive because I'm breaking the rules. This is nice. Loving these pillars. Cool, how are we doing for time? It is currently a little bit after nine, so we have an hour left, so I think I will be able to... Um, now that I've got a pretty good rhythm going, I should be able to finish off the remainder of these, I think. 5 and 9 Pacific time. F oh my gosh! <laughs> then I will definitely have to take a break if that's the case. Um, yeah, so we're going from the top down. Down, which means we'll be back down. We can get lava when we're here next time. Better to have um, slots free. Right, I'll get some. Uh, why you gotta do that? Why you gotta be like that, spider? Uh, 
I guess spiders, if they originate from the dark, are hostile? That's weird. I thought that when they were in the sunlight, they weren't hostile. Shows how little I know. Wait, what did I do with my torches? Alright, let's just stay away from that and let's focus on the project. Actually, make sure none, no more of them are coming. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, six. And then that actually can stay. I think this is where. Oh, did I take out too many? I did, because those are stairs. So put those back in. That's good. Take those out? Yes. Alright, cool. So I get to keep the back solid, which makes me happy because it makes me feel like these pillars are more robust than they would be if I hollowed them out completely. And there are fewer blocks that I have to dig out, so it takes less time. It's six o'clock by uh, six o'clock Minecraft standard time. We're going to dig this all the way down so that we can not have to come back down and do it again. Which will probably just be a few seconds off. Won't be too bad. It would depend. I'm not sure how uh, how eager these mobs are to spawn, but we'll find out soon enough. Take all of the stone we've just gathered, make stairs out of those. Hooray, hooray. I should have checked for creepers. It's one thing I almost never do, and I totally should check for creepers before laying down. Gather all the goodies, go make some stairs. Oh, let's go eat some food first. Sheesh. We might have to make a trip over to the meadows. We're getting low on grub. Uh, where's the stone? Really, that's all we have is 29 stone? Vegan? Um, me in the game? Uh, Somewhat, yeah. Not in real life. I was, but just found it really hard to... Uh... I find the potatoes are just... We've got a farm over there, and so they... are pretty easy to come by. And I find that they're hardy enough that they fill me up. I mean, bread, bread is one of my favorite, because it is very filling in the game. But really, the... Uh... Potatoes are sort of the easiest to... You just pick them and cook them and they're good. You don't have to make them out of anything. Uh, yeah. So that's my only reason. And so I like the... Uh, simplicity of... Uh, ease of obtaining... Build this one up a little bit higher, and then we'll switch to the stone stairs. Turn the corner, do that. Cool, and that, and that. Excellent. Yeah, I love it when things come to... I enjoy trying to figure things out, but then I have this special affinity for uh, once the pattern gets figured out and there's a lot of repeated steps, it's kind of nice to just be able to go, 
um, boop, 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 put everything in the same pattern over and over again and sort of see the idea come together. Come on now, server, don't be like that. We're definitely, definitely going to need to make some more stairs here soon. I was hoping it was going to last me for a while, but it looks like it's not going to be the case. Of course, focus, but the effort is worth it. Yeah. And in some cases, it revires... Like, in, in my case, I should say, it seems like it involves doing and undoing some a lot of times, sometimes. But then once you get it, once you get it just right, it's super satisfying. And I guess one of the thing, the reasons I don't mind it as well, even if I have to do it and redo it, if I have if I built it originally... Oh, no worries, Stegosaurus. Glad you're able to make it. I find that even if uh, even if I have to redo it, if it involves a pattern over and over again, it's not as daunting. How are we doing this evening, Steg? You may have seen the title in terms of me going to help Cosmic, but I, I got over there to help her, and she had... Uh, <laughs> she finished off what I was going to help her do like as soon as I got there. I thought she had died... Well, she did die intentionally, um, just as I was arriving, because she had gotten her elytra and then just killed herself so she could back to the spawn point. So it was, uh, Cosmic made it to an end ship, got another elytra, or got her elytra back, um, without dying at all, except for when it was intentional, which is awesome. Let's go back from family walk. Nice. Maybe we were going to try to do that today, but unfortunately work was a little bit busy and I couldn't get out in time, but yeah, family walks are great. Glad you had a good time. Alright. Actually, um, your timing's pretty good right now, actually, uh, Stegosaurus, because you're going to get to see me, uh, light up this pillar. For we have figured out... A great way to light the interior of this pillar. Oops. Do, 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 do. Uh, like that. Do we have lava on us? We do not. To the lava! Buckets there. Do, 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 do. May have paused for some ice cream. You have regrets or no regrets? <laughs> I can't handle dairy, so I would definitely have ice cream regrets. My kids, though, zero ice cream regrets. No regrets. Gotcha. All right, second source. Here we go. Go in and see it light up. It's so cool. I realize I'm still gonna have to figure out something with the floor to light it up, but this is uh this is very nice, very nice indeed. So we've got two more pillars to do, which didn't take very long to do that one. So we might be able to get the next, should be able to get these next two done before the, um, before the night closes in us, before the, uh, the end of the stream. Cool. And then we'll definitely take another look at this at nighttime. Now that we've got all of these pillars done. Be careful that I don't run out of, uh, yeah, this is actually a, a combination of ideas of from from Firepith, Frostburn, and myself. So I was uh, pretty pleased with how it turned out. Oh, you somebody mentions Tridar. I forget who mentioned it, but it has some nice stone razors. Interesting. So the uh, lighting the pillars was uh, Firepith's idea, and then using stairs was. Frost burns. Uh, yeah, Firepath's idea for the lighting of the pillars. 
using stairs like that is Frostburn's idea, and then I guess the, just the finessing of the details was mine. So I guess this should say the ideas were the boys, but the uh, the final look of it was just a slight tweak on their ideas. But I'm very happy with the way it turns out. Yeah, you might have mentioned Tridar already. I've got that on my uh, subscribe to them, so they're on my list of YouTubers to go check out because they do all kinds of giant monuments. Like, actual monuments. World monuments, not just um, made-up ones. Pretty cool. I'm gonna have to empty out this, uh, this cobblestone. So I've got a bunch of coal, maybe I'll take these... Uh, or I've gotten rid of the furnaces. I forgot. I say I could just go cook all of this. Parthenon build is epic. Nice. I'll have to check those out for sure. So they like his, or is his YouTube channel um, time lapse videos of those? I do. And I like it, but this is the, I guess today I was, I was left questioning, or I found myself questioning whether I want to keep it all the, all the time. I may just pick certain days to be um, for Minecraft music and other days. Not so much. All right, off to make some stairs. Well, that Enderman just got totally scared of me. Couldn't handle the pressure, eh, Ender person? Cross section that displays. He builds it up in creative. Oh wow, that's cool. Stone. Oh, I would still need the right amount, right? Wait, what's going on? Stone stairs. Oh, just stone. Sorry, mini brain failure there. Ha <laughs> ha. Great. Excellent. Um, what should we do with the cobblestone? Should probably just put it in here for now. So I believe that's where it was beforehand. Alright, cobblestone in there. Fence in hand. Not that I need a fence in hand. We should just need that and and food there. So let's do a quick check. I thought I had... Alright, actually, now that we're here, let's go up the ladder so we can get a good glimpse of how this is looking at nighttime. And no Holmes 2 today. Nice. Yeah, that was good. I enjoyed that. Did they have a release date for it? Must be a 2022 project, is it? Yes. That's so good. I'm going to have to come and take a... Once the stream is over, come take a... A centered nighttime shot here. Makes me wish I had shaders on right now. I'm pretty proud. It's coming along so nicely, and I think once the entire thing's done up with the like both the bottom of both floors, and then the top section done as well, it's gonna be pretty awesome at nighttime. Oh, right, that was my idea. So I, I came up with the idea with the lava in the middle. Gosh darn it, creeper. Dear creeper, why you gotta be like that? And of course, as the creeper's coming at me, my finger slipped off the key I wanted to press, so I was just uh, not at all ready to uh, deal with that. Good times, good times. 
Alright, and now we go here, here, like normal. Let's make that one uh, regular stone. That there, and like that. That is incorrect, Steven. Cool. Oops, uh, to the stone stairs already. I get rid of all the cobblestone? That was uh, very short-sighted of me. Right. I did do that. Let's go rectify that problem. Or do I have any cobble here? I do, but not enough. Alright. Wait, I put cobble in here, didn't I? I did. Fantastico. on track. Totally gonna finish the uh, this pillar in the next one before the stream is out, because that one's not going to go all the way down. It's, it's partially embedded into the wall. Or I think we should get them all done anyway. I don't see why we wouldn't. Or you know what? That's just going to be the stream goal now. We're just going to finish finish these two off, and then we'll probably just call it there. Even if it's a little bit before nine o'clock, we'll call it because I have some tired brain. Why? Because I'm not always a smart human and I stay up late watching shows that are entertaining. I mean, I liked the pillars as they looked without the, um, without the lighting, but I'm just trying to put, uh, since I knew I wanted them lit somehow, just trying to find, you know, just trying to make things a little bit more interesting than I would normally do in, in different builds, making them a little bit, trying to make them a little more interesting for myself and for all of you fine folks. Living his best lurk. I'm glad to hear that. Stick is ours. Indeed, I am. That's funny. Right. We are ready for some lava. Did I fill that in? I feel like I felt filled it in and I shouldn't have. I did. Gosh darn it. There. Now that one's done. Need lava. Oops. That's awesome. 
not disappointed with that whatsoever. There we go. And then we will place this in the corner. Right there. Oh, I always seem to be o Ah, jeez, that's dirtled the heck out of me. <laughs> that was almost a legit jump scare. Oh. Uh, why, Steven? Fire went out before I hit it, but that would have been an awesome way to extinguish the fire right there. It was a boss move, actually. Well, a, uh, maybe not a boss move, but I'm impressed with my flying ability. Let's go fill that hole. There's a couple of holes up here I need to fill so that I don't need so I don't fall into lava. All right, Rabelais, no worries. Have yourself a wonderful rest of day, and um, yeah, we'll definitely be seeing you in chat or indoor stream somewhere. Take it easy, my friend. Good to see you. Indeed. Are you streaming? When do you stream next? I feel like I should know this, but I, your stream times are usually when I'm sleeping. We're just about to wake up, I think, so I need to figure out a way to catch some of yours. One, two, three, four, five, six. This feels like it's going to be dangerous to do. <laughs> um... Good. That's good. Can I take care of that one as well? Yes. I didn't realize I've gone down so far. Lovely. So this one will be interesting because this is the first one I'm doing that's embedded into the side of the mountain. So I don't want to hollow out the entire thing. Well, I guess we will go down until we have, um, right to there. Yay, it's a creeper trying to get me, and it probably can because I built stairs into this whole thing. I have to be careful up here. Yeah, I'm not sure what to do here. As that one goes down, and I don't need to take. Um, actually, I guess from here, it's only these two that get taken out now. Or three, I should say. And the downside of this is that I don't have any spare. Well, it's open, but I should take the stone because I will use them multiple times. Not so much with the granite. I'm not much of a granite builder. And not much of an eater of rotten flesh, so we'll just toss those down as well. Does this go down? Oh, all the way. So we should, we should take all these down, all the way down because we want that glow to show up. As long as the uh, corner pillar's there, we want the glow to show. So right down to there, I guess. Cool, yep. Uh, it is bedtime. Let's take advantage of that and get some sleep and drink some tea.
put you in there. I do not need bones. I might as well get get the granite. They make them help. Might come in handy at some point. Um. All right. So um, stairs, stairs. Oh, right. That? No, that's the outside, so that corner's not going to glow. But I just need that for an exit eventually. Okay. Let's do this, and then we'll switch to stone. Completely un. I was going to say unaware if I have enough stones or not, but we. or stone stairs or not, but we do. This is good. Wait, that's wrong. There. I need to be careful because something could fall down right on. But you know what? Let's eat some food now that we notice how uh, how low our hunger is and how low our hearts are. I up there. Cool, we're good. We've remained le safe. Yeah, I think one thing about the, the Minecraft music is it just seems to stop every once in a while, which is fine. I don't. I guess they say that's fine, but I don't want it to stop. So I guess not entirely fine. Oops. Uh, let's do anisite stair there. Because it is being built up again. So we'll do that and we'll switch back. As cute as a cat nose boop, but a boop nonetheless. Oh, right. Um. I forgot how this was all playing out once we got up higher. Clearly. With the oh right, you know he has. And the wait a second. Dun 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 dun. Well that part's done, I should say. Nice, nice, nice. So we have this pillar done. Or this side of pillars done today. I was kind of curious to see, uh, excited to see how this will look, um, partially embedded into the mountain. Oops. And uh, that, and that, and that, and that. Cool. All right. Let's light it up. And then I'm not sure what I'm going to do for the rest of it. Uh, another zombie. Boom. Now it's bright in there. Oh, oh, oh. I sort of wish creepers made noises sneaking up on you, but that would defeat the purpose of them scaring the Yahoo out of you when they get close enough. This one. Just 
press that um, wait can we press that here so what do we do over here then they wouldn't creep true story so that's the top and that's this so to stay consistent I place it there and then do this Moon girl back with the unlurk. Neat. Hmm. Not what he intended, but. I want to go see how this looks. Turn up higher. See how the part that's in the wall looks. Make sure I got it to look right. Yeah, that's good. Nice. Cool. The inside is definitely brighter lit than it was before. Why am I so interested in stairs? Well, um, it sort of started back when I, f when I first started playing Minecraft. I was playing with Frostburn and Firepith. And they took me on these adventures and they were so much faster than I was. I just, I couldn't keep up with them. But we kept, you know, they would, they would dig down low so they could mine for diamonds. They would dig down, down, down. And then every time we would go down and come back up, I found myself having to jump up these kind of annoying stairs all the time these big blocks and i said and i just sort of was a bit frustrated by it and they said well you can always put stairs in there and i went wait what and so <laughs> as i was getting used to minecraft i was basically the stair guy whenever we dug down deep into an area as a team i would then go and make sure the stairs were built to put us back up so it's like one of the first things that i that i enjoyed doing that i sort of took pride in and it just became a yeah it became a thing from there Oh, and I think there's also, uh, is this it? I forget what the command is. Yeah. <laughs> and so this is what I said in my one of my first streams in my single player world was, oh, so I'm gonna check with the chest. But first, gotta grab them stairs. I actually went and before going for the treasure, I dismantled, I took the wood off the boat, off the ship that was usable as stairs. And so that became, became a bit of a joke on stream almost at first after I started on Twitch. All right, those pillars are the done then. Cool, what time is it? It is now quarter to 10. Um, well, let's, you know what? Since we're here, I'm gonna dig up some of this floor because I don't, sadly, I was liking how this was going and then I changed my mind, I'm not a, fan of the shroom lights anymore. I should say I'm not a fan of the shroom lights like this anymore, so I need to figure out a different pattern. Of course, now that I've done this, I realize it's now dark. I need to get some torches. I believe I still have a bunch over here. Oh, yeah, that's right, I put them aside because I would not need them in the end. I just don't remember where I put them. Problem solved. All right, so we'll, place, we'll light up the floor again, figure out a new pattern. Now that I'm done running around frantically. The Roman deity uh, frantically is. Well, that's an awful lot of water. 
Does that mean I have to get rid of... Oh, it's all source blocks. I guess we just need... The quickest way is probably just to fill it in. Alright, we'll do that. Just fill it in with whatever. And we'll come back to it. It's funny, when I first started playing, I kept forget For the life of me, I could not figure out how to... Um, get rid of a bunch of water. Oh! Let's go take another... Take a source with the unlurk. Welcome back. Oh, I should have taken. Totally crossed my thoughts there. I was going to take a look at how it all looked in the nighttime, and then saw the time. I went seven o three. Oh my goodness! I need to go to bed. And then did that without thinking. Well done, Stephen. Well done. Um, let's just unload some stuff in here, so that I can go grab all of these wonderful resources. Do not wish to be wasteful. Probably put most of those in there. Nope, I can't. All right, we're fine. Um, silk touch. Yes. But I feel I feel bad because we sort of came up with the uh, the joint idea of having these all glassed in last stream, and then when I looked at them. The more I looked at them, the more I went, ah, I just don't know. The Boris Love Emote is actually unlocked through bits. So people who have donated the uh, $10 worth of bits have access to a Boris Love Emote. And the nice thing about that is if you ever, you know, at the point where you... The thing I like about the bit emotes, I wish they had them at more frequent intervals, but the nice thing about them is that... Um, once you once you get them you have them forever it's basically like for the ten dollars you get to the level where you've you've purchased it I believe it's ten dollars worth um, should be I'd have to go check to be sure but I'm not. I'm not telling you that to go spend ten dollars on an emote, though. Stegosaurus. Just like I'm pretty sure that's what it is. If you wanted to wait, I can find out for you next time. But again, I'm not saying that as a spend your bits on this emote for only ten dollars. Part of me that still wants to do a water feature somewhere in this temple, but I have not figured out where I want that to be. And just down here, it's feeling like it's the wrong. The blue just seems so vibrant. I don't know that that's what I want. Gather all these goodies up, and then we'll. Uh... Just fill in all of the water. Elkhorn is back. Hooray! Oh, that's... <laughs> I forgot that's what it actually says. Hooray. Oh, my goodness. Stegosaurus, you didn't have to do that. Um, The end run, you did miss it in this... Because I missed it. Um, the uh, I went to help Cosmic, and then on my way there, she had got gotten it. So thank you so much. I should have turned around and say that you didn't have to do that, Stegosaurus, but I wholeheartedly appreciate it. One thousand bits. I told you you're awesome before, but you just there you go. <laughs> and now that is yours for keeps. You have that emote for all your days on Twitch. So that is, uh, I truly appreciate the generosity. You didn't have to do that, but that's awesome. Yeah, didn't have to, but as I said, it is now yours for keys. It's 
realize I'm filling all this in, but I want to change it out for the other types of blocks. So that's what we'll do. We'll bring this this floor back to where it was before we uh, dug all these large holes in it. Thanks, Moon Girl. Pretty happy with that one. I think there's only I think you're one of three people that have that emote. I guess worse. One of three or four, so thank you so much for that. And I hope you get a lot of good use out of it. I think it's you, Cosmic, Turtle, and Hunter Triple Five. Hey. There might be another person. Oh yeah, you got a Did you get a badge? Oh yes, you would have gotten a bit badge for sure, but I think yours is uh, because you've got subscriber, you've got the VIP badge, subscriber, and Twitch Prime badge is not showing up right now. But you have, you do, you've got the, um, the hexagon with, I think, three? I forget. So, sorry, Elcorn, to go back to your question, um, yes, you missed the run, but because I was actually literally equipped and running down there to go help her, and she finished on my way down. So I was not needed at all. I think you have to choose, yeah, there you go, you've got the triple one. So you have to choose, there's only three icon slots. You basically need to choose which ones you want to have visible. That's awesome. Let's do the one there. Two, two, two there, and then we'll go do, do, do. It wasn't a plan. <laughs> well, no, she was looking for somebody to go down with her originally, or wondering if anyone were, was interested, and I thought, yeah, let's, that'd be awesome if I could get off. I would only have to stop, stop working about an hour early, and I could just make that up another time. Thought that'd be fun, but then I had to go get groceries, and then, um... But yeah, no, she did it all on her own. She was super nervous, super cautious the entire way, but... Hey, Zero Fox, your internet qu keeps quitting, so you're going to sign off for the night. No worries at all. There aren't internets, but... Really appreciate that you coming over with the raid and hanging out for the night. Have a wonderful rest of uh, your day, and hopefully we'll catch you again soon. Take care, Zero Fox. We're going to replace mostly with the cracked blocks and then put in the nice shiny ones only every once in a while. Get the stress breathing going. <laughs> yeah, she was a champ. So I was actually in uh, watching in the car on my phone. Even though I wasn't able to chat a whole lot. Um, listening in on her. Proud of that cosmic. She grows, she's growing up so quickly. Watch your VOD then. Yeah, I need to go back and watch it again. Because I saw when she found an end island that had a ship on it. But I didn't actually get to see her get to the top. She did a great job. Cool. Alright, that's already... That's lit back up. How are we doing? It's 9.54. So I think we got the floor figured out. Um, let's, let's do one last um, nighttime pick of this thing. Let's go up here and get some shaders ready. I mean, when you make more great builds, which is often. Thanks. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks so much, Stegosaurus. Truly appreciate it. I think Sunday morning I'm actually going to, um, I have to figure it out. I think my plan is to work on the interior of my uh, spruce tree bedroom because Frostburn designed the interior the other day. And I am also going to um, spend a bit of time working on Cosmic's, oops, 
Cosmic Street again because it's been a little while. There. All right. I think I've got some shaders on me. shaders on me. Oh yeah, let's uh let's try this. Let's see if we can get a nice nighttime shot of this. I forget what all of these shaders look like, so I'm just going to take a peek at a couple of them. Oof, that's a bit realistic. Don't care for that. Oh I'm gonna miss it. That's a nice one. It's a really nice one. I mean, it's too, uh, computer's not powerful enough, the uh, video card's not powerful enough to do it while I, while I stream, but. That's cool. Well, I think that is uh, where I'm going to call it for the night. Yeah, it is. It's pretty cool. But it's uh, it's weird. The computer I have, it's uh, it's my work one. So it's a decent machine for doing graphic design, but it's just the video card and it's not. <laughs> no, the answer is no. There's n never such a thing as too many stairs. The downside, like the, the, it's, I don't do any video editing or any kind of rendering of 3D animation or anything like that. So I don't, I don't have a need for a video card. Whereas, um, I just basically need it to be able to run Photoshop without any issues. Yeah, yeah. Monsters nearby. Of course, there are monsters nearby. There we go. Far, far enough away now. <laughs> Run away! Oh, the skeleton went all the way back up there. We got a bunch of stuff on fire out here right now. Woohoo! Maybe we should hang out in there. Either way, I'm just looking for a safe spot to do my uh, my sign off. So maybe we'll go back into there because back into the uh, the vine farm because the nasties can't get me. So that's where we're gonna call it a night, folks. Thank you so much for stopping by. Made a lot of good progress on the pillars. Fil finished off uh, lighting an entire side, so I'm very happy with that. I am going to probably go and do a bit of tiny tweaking behind the like stuff that people can't see, so uh, I'll do that off stream. But uh, very, very happy with the way those turned out. So Frostburn and Firepith, thank you very much for your input and thoughts on doing that. Um, it's pretty fantastic the way those are lit up now, so very pleased. So everybody, thank you so much. Have yourselves a wonderful night. Stegosaurus, thank you again for the 1000-bit generosity. Too generous, greatly appreciated, so enjoy that boar love emote spread it around <laughs> and everyone thank you again have yourselves a wonderful night and i will be back sunday morning probably working on the interior of the spruce tree and cosmic's tree so everyone have a great night and or great time of day wherever ye be and then we'll catch you later bye